Hello, hello, how are you doing? I hope you're doing good. I hope you're doing amazing. It's always an honor and a pleasure for me to come here to share my time with you. You know, I like to serve you. Okay, I'm here to serve you. My name is Good Lady Pachi. If you're here, it's your first time. Feel free to subscribe, okay? And if you want to grow, you want to make money online, you know that you was made for more. You know that there is something in you can bless someone. You know that you have a, an expertise or you know something can help someone as you are the right channel, okay? So feel free to subscribe and together we're going to grow. So, I'm here to remind you that as a tree, you have a seed in you. You know, every tree has a seed, okay? Any tree, like there is some tree that produce mangoes, some trees produce orange, any trees produce a certain kind of seed, okay? It's the same thing for you and I. God did put within you something can help bless others, something can change people's life. You just have to discover what it is. Sometimes you are looking for it far away. Where can I find it? How can I be a blessing for someone else? I just want to tell you today, don't go far away, okay? Just sit down with yourself and ask yourself, what do I know? What do you know can bless someone else? What can you do to bless someone else? Sometimes you have been going through situation, you know. You have been going through many situations and, you know, you, you came over it. You master it or you master some skill. That is something you can use to bless someone else. I always say that something might seem simple for you, but so for someone else it is a miracle. It is a miracle. What seems so simple for you, for someone that is my be a miracle. Okay? So stop underestimate yourself. You have within you a power to be a blessing for someone else. You have within you the solution for someone else's prayer. So, what can you do to serve people with what you have? It's, it's simple and easy. You know, today we all have Facebook. We all have Instagram account. We all have a uh, TikTok account, okay? If you are afraid as me to do a video on YouTube, start using your, your Facebook, okay? Just post something positive, like a positive message can help someone else. Start, like, posting, you know, use your experience, you know. If, like, you know, like, you, you like to cook. Cooking is something you enjoy doing. Whenever you do a recipe, just take a picture of it. Put a, put a recipe and post it on your Facebook. Only doing that, I'm telling you, it might seem so simple, but it can, it can change someone else's life. Someone else didn't know how to cook that dish, but because of you, the person might be able to do that, okay? Another thing you can do is maybe you have been, you know, you, you, you did divorce or you in your relationship with your husband. At the beginning, it wasn't easy. You master it. You find the solution it and, uh, and, uh, and use it. Use it. Just take what you have been going through, like a situation, one of the case, you know, put it as a post, you know, as a picture. Post a picture and just put a text on it talking about the situation and the solution, how you overcome it. And post it on your Instagram, on your YouTube. Sometimes you master, uh, I don't know, something you master, like a skill, like whatever it is, start sharing with people. If you are not afraid to talk on the camera, you can do a live, a live on IG, a live on a Facebook, on Instagram, whatever, and start sharing your experience. And the more you share, the more you share, the more people are going to get interested. Someone will be, oh my God, thank you for sharing. Oh, thank you, it did help me. And the more you do that, the more you're going to get a feedback. And another thing you can do as well is add value to yourself. Because the more valuable you are, the more value you can bring to others. Start reading books. 
read over and over and over again. Anytime you have a chance to read, every time you have a chance to listen, to go to a conference, go, go where there is information and take it and give it to others. Everything you learn, everything you know is money behind it. Today, knowledge is a currency. So start using it. Or if you can, you can even write a book to monetize what you know, what you have. Okay? Choose the way work for you and start doing it. Okay? Remember, we all going to pass away. We all going to pass away. So when we are on this earth, we have to, to use everything we know to bless someone else. Okay? Because if you bless someone, the person going to go bless someone else. And you know, it's going to be like a chair. Like a tree. A seed. And it's become a big tree, you know. There is different branches. It's the same thing for us as well. So don't, don't underestimate yourself. You are valuable. You are more than enough. No matter what you have been go, going through in your life, you still can heal from it. Master it. And start sharing it with others. Okay? I hope this video will did help you. I hope you did learn something. If it's the case, tell me in the, in the comment below what did you learn and what topic do you want me to talk about. Okay? If it's about money, whenever it is, what you did master, maybe just how to manage your money. You didn't overcome it. You used to spend, you was broke. You have an experience. You can be someone. Okay? Remember, you are a solution for someone else's prayer. I hope to see you next time. And by then, see you next time. Bye. Take care of yourself. And remember, you can do it. You will do it. And you must do it. Not for you, because of the God who called you. Bye-bye. It was Gugeli Party. I was happy to serve you with this message.